as possible so I'm gonna show you guys my low waste grocery shopping it's not completely zero waste but it's what we've got and what we can do outside in Austin, Texas. Oh, shit. It's so cold. I, I don't understand what is happening. So <laughs> we're leaving the market right now. We tried to get everything we needed quickly so that we could get out of the cold and we got coffee. So I'm happy. So we ran by my apartment to grab a couple things before being on with the rest of our day. And guess what? I'm locked out. My my door won't open. My key's not working. So now we have to sit out here in the cold and wait for maintenance to come help us. Yay. I'll update y'all when we get in. Maintenance guy's still not here, but Wi-Fi goes through walls. So getting work done in the meantime. Always hustling. We were able to get to my apartment, yay! So we actually were just gonna stop by here and grab a couple things and like go, and a 20 minute stop turned into two hours. But that's life, right? Now we're really hungry and I can't wait to go have lunch. and I am starving and I think everybody else is. Cheers, cheers, cheers. cheers. More cheers. We came back 
up to my grandma's hotel room because my birthday is in a couple days, so we're actually celebrating with her today. And I'm about to open the card she gave me. First of all, tie-dye rainbow. It's a neat card. She who never gives up. Never, never, never. Doesn't that sound like you? Yes. A wonderland looking. Yeah. Thank you guys. I didn't find a happy birthday card that said what I wanted to say. No, this I, is beautiful. I fell in love with that. I love this card. One. I'm, hang, I'm here hanging out with my grandma. She's and the best. Grandma. She's vegan. Almost. This, I, I, this little... I cheat. I cheat a little bit. <laughs> That's okay. She's mostly vegan. She does a good job. I'm veganish. Yeah, that. Veganish. So we need to go down there. Yeah, it's, do it's finally there. getting a little warm out yeah. here, so I think we're gonna go check out the backyard. A hotel has a backyard. I'm very curious. <laughs> what is this? This is it, guys. This is the backyard. Is there like a button? Oh, it's a timer. Oh yeah, now it's coming on. See, look how neat. the day's errands we're about to run home and then I can show you all the haul everything we got today we just got home and I'm about to show y'all everything I got I just wanted to get on here and say though that I am only about a year into this minimalist, low waste, learning about how to live a more sustainable life. So we do our best. We don't necessarily have time to make things like tortillas or yogurt or almond milk. And I would love to, and I know how to make all of these things. I just don't have the time right now. So this was our grocery haul. We did the best that we could, and I want all of y'all out there to know that every little bit counts, every little bit helps. Just do what you can, and try not to stress. It's a learning process, and we're all learning together. Okay, I'm gonna show y'all all the stuff I got at the farmer's market first. So, all of the places at our farmer's market that have jars, if you bring their jar back, they'll give you a discount on their stuff. So these two, we got some granola butter, which is so, it's so good. Some tomatilla salsa, 
some dino kale and some curly leaf kale. And then this is coffee that we get from the pecan farm. It's pecan coffee, it is the best. And I will leave a link to all of the shops that we get these at because if you live anywhere within the Houston, Austin, Dallas, San Antonio area, anywhere in like mid Texas, you can order from the, these guys online or you might even find some of them at your lo local farmer's market. Moving on to stuff we got at the store. A couple bananas, some vanilla yogurt, some vanilla almond milk, which I would love to make these so that they wouldn't come in plastic, but I genuinely don't have the time currently. So that is something I am working on. We also got almonds in our own little jar. This used to be a dressing jar and now it's got agave in it. We're lucky that we have a large bulk section. My partner got some spiced chili mangoes and some plantain chips. He really likes these for snacks. We also got a big thing of dates. I love snacking on them or using them in smoothies and of course the bliss ball recipe from last week. Also got a bottle of wine because I like wine, but also because my birthday's in a few days. So that will be for that. We found these seaweed chips and I know that they're in plastic, but we got each flavor to try. And if we really like them, then I can look into a way of either making them or buying them that's uh, less wasteful than this. Some Cheddar Jack cheese, some flour and corn tortillas, and then we also got these chickpea flour ones. This brand sells really yummy chips and queso, so we figured we'd try their tortillas also. And then TVP. Now, you used to be able to find TVP in the bulk section, and now I can't find it there. I have to buy it in a bag. They also don't have it in all of the Whole Foods, so I'm pretty upset about this. I wish that they still carried it in the bulk section, but I guess not very many people buy it anymore. And then down here, we've got a little shoe storage cubby thing that we're gonna put in the closet so that we have a place to put our shoes because currently they are spilling out onto the floor everywhere and I would like all of that organized. So that was my little haul for today. I hope this inspires you to do what you can, take action, and look into the ways that you can be a little less wasteful. Hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments what you're struggling with trying to be low waste or to be less wasteful. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter so you can see what I'm cooking up with all of these groceries. I am the Vegan Rainbow. Thanks for watching. Bye y'all. Thank you.